This is a uh, circuit board, snap mm -hmm. circuits. Mm -hmm. I've got a couple batteries here, and then I have an LED, a light emitting diode. Okay. LEDs are one of the most amazing technology. Colors so vivid, so rich, and they take very, very little power. And so the power comes out of the battery, goes through the LED, and then it goes through a resistor here. And a resistor is a part of a circuit that resists the flow of electricity or controls how fast electricity will flow. Then I've got a switch so I can turn it on and off and then it goes back to the battery. So if you hook batteries up directly to an LED, it's very possible, depending on the number of batteries and the particular LED you use, but it's very possible you'll burn it out and the LED will go like a flash bulb and it's gone forever. It's throwaway. So when you run power through an LED, you have to make sure that you control the amount of power and how fast it's flowing so it doesn't burn it out. And that gets into having a resistor in series. So the power is going through the LED and on its way back to the other side of the battery, it has to go through the on-off switch, but also has to go through a resistor. A resistor is an electronic component this particular one, I believe, is a carbon resistor. So it has carbon in there that resists the flow of electricity, or in other words, it slows it down. Resistors have these little tiny lines on them with their color coded. I don't know if we can get tight enough here to see that. Can you see those little lines on there and how they have different colors? Each of those colors represent a number. And by reading those numbers, you can tell how much resistance this particular part has. The last band down here is a band that tells you the tolerance of the device. So if you have that code memorized, you can tell what the resistance is just by looking at it. If you don't have it memorized and you Google what the colors are, resistor codes, and you can still read it, okay? okay. So the question though is for an LED, what resistor should you put in series to protect it? Mm. And if you put a bigger resistor, it will make the light dimmer because not as many electrons will flow through. If you lower the resistance, the light will get brighter because more electrons will flow through. If you don't put the resistor in, you will flash the LED and make it disappear and go off. Okay. Never to come on again. Never to come on again. So you need to choose the right resistor. And we do all kinds of circuits where we're doing something like this and we need to decide what size resistor to put in.